so I was going through my yarn stash, which is kind of organized. I need to wind those up. Sorry. Um, I was going through my yarn stash, which is kind of organized besides for like, besides this stuff. And I found all of these tiny little balls of yarn at the bottom of my stash. And I decided to dig them up because they're not going to do any good just sitting there. So now I need something to use them up for, right? But I already had my eyes on this sweater vest from I Admit That. I'm obsessed with it. It's beautiful. Well, the only thing is the creator used four different colors for each side in kind of a diagonal pattern, right? And I kind of want to use up a whole bunch of yarn. So I was thinking I might just kind of go and just make a whole bunch of different squares. I don't want to have to slip stitch them together later. So I am going to try and do intarsia properly. <laughs> so that's all. Just wanted to let you know. I'm starting yet again another project. Another project yet again. My English grammar is a mess. That's that. Anyway, bye. A few moments later. Alright, I can bear it no longer. I'm just gonna start it. Um, I was planning on using all this stuff. It's not happening anymore. We're just gonna use these colors. Actually, wait. <laughs> Whoops. I think I will use that. It looks better on camera than it does in person. <laughs> I counted the stitches and the rows in the picture, and it looks like it's 10 by 10 stitches and rows for each square. Um, yeah, we're just gonna do our best, and hopefully it turns out well. Bye! rows of two by two root and then I did like an increase row it looks a little weird but basically now it's time to start the intarsia part so I need to look up how to do that and I will come back and show you guys how it goes bye bye I am oh just FYI I'm not going to go very far today I'm just going to wow I looked up intarsia oh look at these sweaters okay. anyway Anyway, hello. Uh, I am focused again. I am. I am present with you. I am. Fo I am focused. I'm just going to start the intarsia tonight. I'm probably not going to do. I'm going to try to limit myself to two rows, and then go to bed because I'm very tired and I have to get up at six thirty tomorrow morning, despite it being a Saturday. And I have a performance tomorrow. <laughs> so, um, I lied, and I ended up knitting five rows instead of two, because Intarja is surprisingly easy to, easy to knit, and kind of addictive. I'm going to shower and go to bed now. Wish me luck tomorrow with to, wish me, <laughs> wish me luck, yeah, I need to go to bed. Wish me good luck tomorrow with my performance. <laughs> okay, just before I go to Please stop with the mumbling. You know how I feel about the mumming. Blah, 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 blah. It's very annoying. <laughs> Before we go to bed. Wow, that looks kind of ugly. Okay, one minute. <laughs> uh. So, I like how it's turning out so far. I feel like this color looks prettier in person. It's kind of like a rosy, ro dusky, like rose color. Anyway, so I'm doing purple on one side and like teals and blues on the other, and I'm really excited. Hee <laughs> hee. Anyway, good night. <laughs> okay, I promise I'll actually film myself knitting sometime soon. Why you always um, lie? But for now, I've started my decreases for the shoulders. Um, I really like the way the colors are turning out. I think it's super pretty. I'm very satisfied with it. Uh, yeah. Snacks have been consumed. Water has been drunk. <coughs> One assignment of many has been done.
um yeah it's time for a break <laughs> i'm going to sit here and watch a video from wavy while knitting having to decrease three times here instead of twice because I did something wrong earlier um, but aside from that pretty smooth sailing a few moments later it's kind of too late to be reconsidering my entire existence and creation of this project but looking at this I'm starting to think that maybe it's supposed to be made out of like bulky weight yarn but I think it'll still fit me so that's good Anyway, yeah, bye. <laughs> so, I have just barely finished this, um, and I've run into a bit of a dilemma. Um, it's only about 36 centimeters long, which, on me, is not very long at all. It'll be like a crop top, but it's fine. <laughs> I was prepared for this. Um, yeah, it's. I think it's wide enough though. I measured it. I'm just going to stick you underneath my chin. Um, I measured it from here to here. Ah, it's rolling up. Ah, I bet. Yeah. So it's about 26. So that means that when I make the other half, it'll be like 52 centimeters across the front and across the back because I'm just gonna make the back in the exact same way, only minus the color work. So, I'll have more than enough room in terms of, like, chest stuff, but not in terms of length. So, that sucks a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> anyway. Stop! Bye! Okay, so I'm sorry for not having filmed much these past, <laughs> um, this past few days. But now that i finished the first two parts, I kind of know what I'm doing, so I'll film more for the next front piece and the... Um, next back piece. I'm going to start the second front piece now, and I'll see you later. Uh-huh, so I lied. I'm probably not going to film much of this at all. So this won't really be a very good video. It'll be really, really short. Why you always lying? This is how it's working up so far. It's really cute. <laughs> See you later. final piece of this sweater vest um i really love the way that the front turned out all right so i finished the second half i'm going to sew this together now i kind of wish that i just knit it all in one piece but oh well it is what it is um so basically i'm going to sew it together sew these pieces together and then sew it together with the front and yeah Every witch and wizard aid our homeland.
Lizard Jenkins must report to the palace immediately. That's all. That's the biggest character development right there. You should go home yeah. anyway and tell your king to stop this dumb war. Yes, that's exactly what I'll do. One thing you can always count on is that hearts change. Hello. It is 10.30. I have school tomorrow, but I finished the vest. I think it is very cute. I know it is very cute. Thank you for paying me such a wonderful compliment. I need to go to sleep because I am chronically sleep deprived and am thus th therefore a danger to society. So I'm going to go to sleep. But I did actually succeed in weaving in all the ends while my friends and I, <laughs> friends, friend, singular, singular, while my friend and I were watching Howl's Moving Castle. Um, I will be back with reflections and final thoughts tomorrow. One eternity later. I have tried filming this outro four times now. So, we're just gonna do this and we're gonna get it done. Because I am cranky and tired. Here's the obligatory joke that I had planned. Haha, <laughs> I almost forgot to put on my mask before coming in front of the camera. Wouldn't want to give you COVID, that's the end of the joke. Because it's not a good joke. It's an ironic joke because I probably do actually have COVID. Um, I'm in close contact with people who do have COVID and I don't feel so great. So it's very likely that I do have it or that I will get it. Um, I was really hoping to be one of those cool people who like gets through the pandemic and was like, haha, I didn't get COVID, but I did. So here we are. Um, yeah, some reflections about the project. Doesn't feel very much, very nice. I've worn and washed it several times now doing pretty great love the colors uh one thing that i wish that i had changed is this can you see this neckline i really wish that i had taken my time to figure out a better way to do this because it's just not working um now because again i'm trying to go fast because i don't feel good um a bit of a teaser as to what i'm hoping to accomplish on this channel for the, for the next couple of months my first piece of Enhypen merch, so I'm very excited. Uh, yeah. Putting that away until I actually get around to putting it up on my wall. Anyway, so, um, it's like my last summer that I have of like being a high school student before I'm like a pre-college student, you know, because I'm about to go into my senior year. Um, hopefully I'll get a lot of stuff done this summer. I hope that, uh, that it'll be really fun. Anyway, just, so if you're interested in any of that stuff, I know that most of my content is about either knitting or K-pop, but hopefully it's still entertaining. If you're not into that stuff and you don't feel like subscribing, it's cool to see you around. If you are interested, then feel, sub feel to free to subscribe to the, Grim to the Gremlin Army, which is, as of right now, only 10 strong, including myself. Uh, but yeah, and I'll be the cat that wanders in and out of your subscription feed. Um, yeah, I hope that you guys are all well. I hope that you don't get COVID because even though my symptoms aren't that extreme, it still sucks to feel sucky. So yeah, anyway, bye, be well. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Bye, this is the last bye of the video. Savor it, bye. Why you